Oh my gosh, a giant and a balloon on the tower! Can the Valkyrie get there and get one hit? No, it can't. Fuck you, Valkyrie. Here we are with the giant balloon deck. Obviously, we're using the giant and the balloon, the wizard, the Lexic Collector, arrows, princess, Valkyrie, and the freeze spell. So please, guys, go ahead and enjoy this balloon giant, the giant balloon deck gameplay. So guys, basically as you can probably see, 2,000 subscribers is very, very close and what I would love to do for 2,000 subscribers is a QA. and I would love you all to just ask me some random as question down in the comment section below. Write hashtag Q&A and ask me the most randomest questions that you can think of. So here we are obviously in the replay. Already been a couple seconds. This guy is going to zap my tower with spear goblins on it. I'm not too sure what he was really thinking then. If he thought his spear goblins could actually take down that tower or not. Or he just wanted to get a little bit more hit points off. But either way, I don't feel as though that was a very good move. So I've got my giant going up with my balloon. Luckily, he has gone the golem. Because now all three of these troops are just going to walk straight past each other. Like they don't even know each other. Look. Golem and Giant literally just walking straight past, wait for that perfect time to freeze, and there goes the freeze whilst he drops down his minion horde. I've got the Valkyrie on the Golem as well as the Princess. I was really hoping for that Princess to get the minion horde down, but obviously it wouldn't if it's targeting the Golem already. The Wizard is going to take a fair bit of damage out of all of that, and now... We have the wizard against the prince S and obviously the princess is going to win because the wizard didn't even know she was there. He was just too busy freezing my tower. But we are going to be getting along in this replay. He's going to drop a golem right on my princess. Not too sure about that. And the princess is just going to do some free work on that and now he has gone into the middle of the map i have both crown towers and the king tower all doing work on that golem right there because he had already damaged my king tower and that is a very stupid move if to damage the king tower if you haven't gotten rid of a crown tower yet because then his cannon is going to come out and it's going to do extra work like it did to that golem right there it absolutely pounded it down <laughs> He is going to fireball the last little 40 hit points left of that tower. And now we're going to be pretty even. He is going to drop his three musketeers in. I'm going to freeze that down very perfectly. Wizard gets rid of two of them. And the wizard is going to die as the giant is going to take a couple hit points off. Now he's got a pretty solid push, I guess, coming into my side. The musketeer with the ice wizard. Luckily, the princess is one bad-ass card and can take things out before they can even get to her. I absolutely love the princess card. It is very awesome. Three seconds left. Drop in my giant and my balloon. He goes straight for the golem. My little princess over there is perfectly getting rid of those minion hordes. That's why the princess is awesome. Can the giant and the balloon do the work? Yes, it can. Can take it all down. And now we're going to jump straight ahead into the replay. Hopefully get ourselves two crowns so we can get our crown chest and hopefully get the ice wizard in this crown chest. So here we are against Hulapulakilabuzu from Legend. He's currently sitting at 2621 trophies. And I'm just going to start off by dropping in the wizard at the back because I like to have the Alexa collector in my first hand. He is going to reveal his golem card, which is very good because I literally just beat a golem deck in that replay you saw before. So I kind of know how to do this. And obviously, I will see how we go. That was probably a very bad time to drop that Valkyrie. I'm not too sure why I dropped it so early. I probably should have let the Prince hit the Alexa Collector first. But you can't change the past and we'll just keep moving on with this replay. I'm just going to go for a full push over there because I have had nothing to even get rid of that Golem. Besides if I wanted to freeze it. But I wanted to save the freeze for right now. Probably should have waited a little bit. 
until he dropped his minion horde, but he probably just had a feeling I was going to drop the freeze anyway. I still got the tower down as he got his my tower down, so that was a double trade right there. But still, we got the tower. We just need one more crown. He's going to arrows my princess all we need is one more crown to get the crown chest even if we don't win and we get one more crown i will be happy because i am going to get a wizard in this crown chest i am telling you guys i'm gonna do it so i'm just gonna play safely right now put the alexa collector right in the middle right there just waiting for it to get to 10 alexa and then drop it in case he tries to do some crazy push and i need a counter but he didn't so the alexa collector is gonna go in now we're just going to build ourselves back up to 10 Alexa. He's going to drop a dragon straight in. I'm going to counter that with the wizard. Now I'm going to have a full health wizard. And I'm going to drop in the giant and the balloon right behind it. And with the wizard in behind it. Luckily he did put the golem on the other side. I'm going to freeze the crown tower and quickly freeze it and get the arrows in there. Can they get there before? Yes they can. The minion horde didn't do much damage to my giant at all. That balloon didn't even really need to drop a bomb on that Alexa Collector now. Now the giant and the balloon are on the king tower whilst he has a full push going on the left hand side. Are we going to get this? Yes, we are going to take the three crown win. That is awesome. Three crown win twice in a row in the replay and the live attack. Now we have the 10 out of 10 crowns to open up our crown chest let's see what we get 270 gold two gems 12 teslas 13 knights three bomb towers and one witch well i don't really use any of those cards but that is okay hopefully i'll get the ice wizard soon that is going to wrap it up for this video guys remember hashtag q a in the comment section below 2000 subscribers you guys are all amazing there is 2000 of you wow and other than that peace out everybody and enjoy your day